do it. Let's Hello, do it. everyone. This Hello. is your weekly dose Hello. of zombies. You know about raindrops Hello. in Black Ops 3. I do. But what about in World at War? What about in transit, though? That was Whoa! Great. Whoa! I've never... What the f... There is no way. This has to be modded. World at War was different, man. That game's drop cycle is so bizarre. Right, here we go. There's the transit gameplay I've been waiting for. This man's done. Or is this town? This is probably town. Oh, this man is done, skis. How is he still in it? Bro, the town clutches went different, y'all. The 2012 town clutches went absolutely different. I can't even lie. Uh oh. Bro, a nine fail. <gasps> what? He got sucked out of the map. And he lost his Helion. <gasps> no. Just end the game. End the game at that point. And he's under the map? No way am I sitting out the rest of this. End the game. Oh my gosh, bro got fumbled on. Does it really I've need never to be said? seen something cold so Cold War sad. will be Cold War. Chat, I'm excited. MW2. What? This is happening in MW3. This exact gameplay, boys. Yes. I'm telling you, I see a new glitch on Outbreak every freaking day. Outbreak 2. Modern Warfare 3. Lads, I'm telling you, I guarantee you the Modern Warfare 3 fails are gonna be out of this world wild they're gonna be something else Ugh, classic buried let's hit it with the buried gameplay boys oh he's done doesn't have double tap oh man dude the church or like where the where the vault trade is one of the worst areas to hoard ever so the gambler bad. and all around enhancement clutch. is one of the features of all time oh my goodness yeah, bro, so there's a there's a mod called All Around Enhancement. I guarantee you this one ends his game. One of them can just end your game. After five seconds, everyone dies or the idiot dies. Everybody just dies. Everyone gets killed by idiots. Idiots survive. Idiots have percolic. Oh my gosh. Wait, so his friend just died. I've had one where I played it. Activated the gambler and the game just freaking ends and I was on like round 30. What a joke Bro Lads this guy Mal was in my stream when we were doing the buried round 100 look at this 213 on buried I saw some of these sick clutches he hit Oh my gosh, these are absolutely wild fam They got big guy for the tier one Dude like yeah, my man's got some cursed textures on, but dude, this clutch, I think it's right here. <gasps> no, he errors! No! 54 hours in, fam. No! Error due to Galva Knuckles. Oh my gosh. Chat, there it is. Don't buy Galva Knuckles. Don't ever buy Galvin Knuckles. That is insane. 40 minutes on this one round alone, it says. What's the worst part? 213 is not even my highest round. Ma, what the frick? You want to take a wild guess as my highest round? Did you hit the world record? I know the world record is like 239 now? Or is it 236? round above where he erred he went all that way to get a round before his world oh, bro with there being 10 iterations i'm of Todd so Zombies sorry and a whole bunch of weapons between all of them i'm so even, like, freaking like sorry and stuff like that that IW, hurts you know it's bound that, that there'd horrid. be a few weapons that have a few oh my gosh that is so sad a few things that are kind of weird with them well, in this I case, so we're going to be looking run. at a gun in COD World War II, Fifty hours and that is this NZ-41 like right here. Probably simultaneously one of the best and worst assault rifles I've never heard of this weapon in my whole little life. unintentional quirk that this weapon has. 
And this Lads, does one in chat if y'all still play World War II zombies. I this is the game I play the least. I actually play Exo Zombies more than this game. And Vanguard. Restoration, I do see not the play still this game at punched. all. It's round 13. It was in Vanguard. And it's still able it to looks like it was in Vanguard. Shot body shot all of the zombies. So it's a really strong. That is just insane get out of the though. Box, like really early on and keep. From yeah, one shotting. Unfortunately, that's shots. about when the positives end for this weapon because the problems start to arise whenever you go and try to pack a punch it. As you can see here in this gameplay. It was easily one shot body shotting before, but whenever you upgrade it, it used to be the Warzone it, one meta. It out, I mean, I can understand. It no longer does that. Wait, what? When you pop it, it's worse. Pack punch and non pack punch for this weapon are actually flipped, and it's really unfortunate because it has a pretty unique. So it's pack punch when you get it out of the box, non pack punch. Functional video game. A weapon ability whenever it's upgraded. Functional but video upgraded, game. It becomes pretty much completely useless. Bro. That's so, insane. Again, it's a really nice weapon to just get. How did people figure that out? While, that's in, as soon as that's you pack wild. Punch, it becomes completely useless. With me doing this whole like, eight hundred reserve thing, ammo of a uh, non-pap weapon. Coming across by the way. a couple of situations where it was just weapons. Kind I cannot of tell the difference between World War II and Vanguard of, anymore. Uh, quirks like the that, main so difference: World War II has perks here. Vanguard has it in the middle. from the only one. That is for sure, and it's not. I've even never heard of this thing. as a like, problem. I'm sure there are even some weapons in Treyarch games that have some sort of. No, nah, man, I've never heard of it like, like this, this, where they fully but, uh, fumbled the damage no on pap and non papped Most people that's would just crazy, never know things fine. like that. What but the heck? Is there any gun that, that you guys uh, can anyways, think of that's though, like that's that? I can't. For, uh, this what map time? even is this? This is a tortured path map. This is like a survival map. It's the second map on tortured path. I don't even know what the name of it is. I can't believe that. GG devs. Hard at work, by the way. Oh, my man's playing Revelations. I thought this was Zerai's track, but no, it's Rev. Man, what a trippy way to start it. I thought it was DE, but no, it's Rev. disappeared in a flash of a second how the spawns on rev are really odd i think it's because of the islands bro took it the g strike to his head it did nothing excuse me man hit the in plain sight on him bro that's why recently we saw the alternate ending cutscene for garod crovey but yep. what about the alternate ending cutscene oh, no. for revelations here it is oh, just wipe you from existence what is about to happen fam That all works out perfectly. He just disappeared. What am I hearing? I'm hearing the freaking Samantha box. What the heck? Oh, it's the Fortnite thing, bro. You cannot be doing this to me. I was like, what is this for the longest time? I thought this was like some sort of Samantha thing. Nah, you cannot do that to me. I was like, what the heck is that? Is that like Samantha? No. Bro. The die rise fails, man. We're bringing this back. This is playable. Oh, he's going to instantly die there. Yep. I knew that because that's where zombies uh, spawn. Just so you know, this is 100% a canon event. I do remember seeing this in the Cronorium. Richtofen 100% got kicked in yes, the face by Dempsey over on Max <laughs> Ammo. It's in the Cronorium 100%. What All the right, heck? I guess these two were just messing around with infection mods. Oh here my on gosh, the boys are out of this, the map. Like, invisible wall outside the map. I mean, yeah, That's they probably really don't want you there. As much context as I got with this clip, so um. What the frick are y'all doing? Yeah, I guess you can. Man, you gotta be a you next level type of board to be playing outside of Nuketown 2025 zombies map, bro. Whoa, what the heck? They're finding balls. There's balls outside of the Nuketown map, bro. Die Rides needs a whole video, bro. Yeah. I'm telling you, boys, we'll probably get a bunch of them once the, the map releases for, for BO3. There's balls outside of Nuketown zombies, confirmed. Actual ball sacks waiting still looking better than vanguard look at the zombie too what the heck is wrong with him it's like a person and it's like what the frick was that y'all see that those balls outside of nuketown 
There's hunched over zombies that look like humans. What's going on there, bro? All right, we got just a little quick thing here to it. show that it's the year 2023 and speedrunners just don't know how to Lovely say no and they bebop. just keep finding new things about origins. Bro, and, uh, exactly. How is this going to be towards the speedrun? I don't know, but anyways, new things Pay discovered in the year 2023. Oh, bro, this was Scotty Dog's clip. Lads, if you have not seen this, look at this. Scotty is able to go through this whole mud track without getting the whole stone dirty. That is insane. That's gonna, boys, that's gonna increase the world record by one second. One second faster. I'm telling you. That skip alone. Right, that's alone. all I got for this video. That's a got crazy clips, below. skip. Yada yada, all that. Oh my goodness. With all that being said. Okay, W first video, Lucario. Let's go on to the next one. Insane clutch tra uh, trapped in the mob dead Hello, dog's everyone. cage. This what the your frick going on, my dose of zombies. I thought he was cheating. He definitely was, man. Oh no, it's a tram clutch, bro. What? Oh. <laughs> I've seen that before, but never in the middle there. How does that even happen? That's easily lag right there. That's some fat lag, bro. He just hit right there. Oh my goodness, what map is this? This looks. Oh, it's the FNAF map! This is FNAF the movie! Oh my goodness! Lads, if this is FNAF the movie, I gotta go check it out. Oh my. Oh, that zombie blood! <laughs> Look at the top left. <laughs> oh, he's dead. On BL1, he's dead. Oh! Oh, the clutches! The world of war be a one zombie system. Voice chat may so have bugged clutch. out for the first part of this clip, but I believe this guy over here said something along the lines of "Watch me get the kraken." Bo four voice chat, you gotta be down bad. No shot. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking did. I made it. What is that love? <laughs> Bro, laugh like the Joker right there, bro. What the heck was that? That's so funny. Oh no! The monkey bomb fell into the crack on split screen. Oh, that is so sad. I've never seen that before. That's a fat Nuketown L right there. Jeez. I'm gonna go ahead and say it. This is probably one of the most insane clutches that I've ever had submitted to the series the so cackle, far. Man. Thank you, Lionel. Wait, how do I get out? Bro, I've seen a couple clutches in this area. You have these, to shock it again? These clutches uh, are you, you, what did you get, nasty. What did you get the part? I, I, I already have a part, so it doesn't let me... No, we even need to, that's not how this map works. The fact that you're able it's, to it's, even it's, it's clutch no in an area have, that looks like an actual letter 8. No. Or letter 8. Number 8. I, um... I don't oh know, I don't gosh. know, I don't know, I'm sorry. No, it's fine. I, I'm is he able to, to get out? Is the gate up? When you can, Bro, the gate up. is up! We can't shoot for defense. Oh, you can? Just throw an eight. Wait, no. well, is if it I throw an eight, the I letter eight, boys? I can throw an eight. You, you, talk, you didn't no, know about the letter eight? Fire. He's so, oh my gosh, how are you alive? Uh, that's how? They're throwing nades to help him out. He's he's running so hard he's lagging through his space and time. Oh my, he's dead. He's dead. He was he's he, he's been red screen for like the past 15 seconds. Oh my god. He's still red screen. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What a dude! The gate is closed. Why is the gate closed? Oh, because he doesn't have afterlife to open it up again. He literally has to end the round. He somehow stayed alive. What the heck? I now understand. All right, we all oh love theater gosh. mode, but at the same time, that when is the wild. last time you've ever actually used theater mode, especially in like Black Ops 3, to actually create something? Oh man. I did it this year because I make memes on on uh, on theater mode, but very rarely. Oh my goodness, my man's actually, he's showing the theater mode, the theater mode fails up in here. I survived 40 rounds in that room. Boys, what's your record for Ruck spawn room? I'm gonna be honest, mine's probably round five. He's rocking the annihilator, he's dead. <laughs> the 
The annihilator clutch for him. He came in hot with that. Hey, did Rick Toppin send Round you two, as soon as I have enough points, I'm out, bro. That's what I'm saying. Some people have literally been able to survive in the Varrock room to like if round 30 in the spawn. Like, freaking, how is that even possible, man? Bro's got the dolly camera setups, bro. I'm watching this on the CTTV camera footage right now, boys. Bro's got the footage set up. Lads, how much time do you think he put into this theater mode footage? This man's making a movie out here. Oh my goodness. All oh, the Nuketown clutches are wild. S tier cinematography. Oh no! Yo, bro, no, come on, Scepter not through Roderick, there. They said it's extremely overpowered. They said Scepter Raw on solo is definitely not overpowered. This is Kaka. Yeah, there's like a fast melee glitch. Is he gonna get bullied? Oh, he's bullied. Oh, he's not hitting it. He's not hit. Yeah, he died. What the heck? He just went from full health practically to zero in a second. Me playing transit literally right now. Oh, the Zetsubo fails are iconic, man. I love these. Uh-oh. Those are a bit too Yeah, why do they spawn zombies in there with you? <laughs> why do they do that? It's like he brings all the zombies there with him. What the frick? Oh my gosh. I don't even know what zombie map this is. Bro just ran into a ghost and got bullied. All QR's gone at round 15, bro. This is truly me. That's crazy, fam. What map is this? This looks good. It looks like a transit map. They got like a school bus transit back there or something? I don't know if we both landed on two I don't know what happened there. What the heck, fam? Chat, do you guys nail the trivia when you watch these? I feel like I never get the trivia right. I ever. don't remember the exact context never. or whose video it was, but basically so a little while ago, I recall someone making a comment on an Origins related video uh, saying that they used to troll Lightning Staff users by supposedly turning the unused lightning staff oh. switch that's uh, located in the center building before oh my no gosh land. that's you know, the ruthless one that no one touches and the one that uh so yeah, yeah if it, you don't know there's a switch in the mound area that's always on the correct spot always as soon as you spawn it it's always there and if you switch that switch you can't do the upgrade oh my gosh that's ruthless people would be pissed at you is just not used. Oh my because, gosh! Well, people. I never even that, knew well, that. Either they don't that know that it people even are exists, evil or for that. that. There's no need to turn it because it's already set. Oh, that is uh, ruthless. To, uh, the direction that it needs to be set in order in order for this. Oh, I would be correctly. pissed so, on Bo two or three on you know, both. I thought I would pick put yeah, this to the test. Nobody so includes it in their guides because why would you? You just don't have to spin it ever. I didn't include in my guide. Why would you include something so useless like sure. that? This is something that should have been super wow. straightforward. I should have just been able to. Uh, oh my gosh! What I'd, I'd be so angry if that was the case. Turn the dial so that I can find out exactly when this switch is supposed Chat, to be. Chat, no! Order, which, now everybody uh, watching I this is gonna that do it was gonna this. Be after the Gen Three switch, since that no. would make the most sense in terms of just walking order and how it would normally oh go my when gosh. you're. Uh, Turning the switch. That is a rare bit of origin trivia that I'm almost 99% sure most people would not know. Just whatnot, if you know. I remember seeing that switch IQ though by going through the, the mound like, area and being you know, like, "Why is that there?" In year 2023. But anyways, that's not important. Here we are in that is three so origins. The so it doesn't work. That's the question. Off of its preset, and let's see what happens. Does it work? Maybe it doesn't work. Or maybe it still works. He's hitting all the switches. Something has changed. No. What? No sparks. What? It doesn't matter? No way. 
Wait, so you can't right, troll so people like that? Alright, so looks like that little bit of trolling detail has been debunked for when it comes Maybe to- Maybe it only works on BO2. It probably doesn't work on BO3. Okay, that's odd. To Black Ops 3. I did not know that. What about Black Ops 2? Okay, Once let's again, see. we will turn it off of its Just default setting BO2. and try it again. What the heck? So what's the point of that switch then? There's just an extra lightning staff switch that's just there? What? That's so bizarre. I thought for sure it was always just right. And no matter what, what no sparks. What the heck? It still works on BO2. It doesn't matter. So then what's the point of that thing? And just like that, we have arrived at a total bogus claim. Whoa! Which I guess is probably a good thing for us Lightning Staff enjoyers, but... I'm telling you, I learn something new about Origins every single day. <laughs> like, it is insane! This map is the map that keeps on giving. Like, what the frick? Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed coming down this rabbit hole with me. What is the purpose of this then, bro? This has to have some sort of purpose. Like, did Treyarch just forget about coding this switch? They just left it? I must be some sort of secret or something. Maybe it is an Easter egg. Back huh. to the regularly scheduled clips. What the heck? I thought for sure if you swapped it, it wouldn't get the staff working, but it's just a dud. It's literally just there. Oh my gosh. Wow. I, I Honestly, that kind of blew my mind. I never would have guessed that that is a thing. Sheesh. I guarantee you it's probably a cut Easter egg or something. Or Treyarch just said, I forgot, lol. That is... That was really cool. I never expected that to be a thing. Lucari with the Mythbusters, bro. The where are the meatballs going, bro? bro? <laughs> The Ladies and gentlemen, fly, I give man. you the very definition of spray and pray in Dude, zombies. Let's see it. Oh, bro, when you're in a corner, you just hold down the trigger, hope for the best. These moments freak me out, man. Look at him go. Look at him go. Oh, my goodness. That is crazy. Bro had the stock option, too. Yeah. If he didn't have that, bro would be dead. He would be dead in the water. Stock option is definitely one of the best classics, like without a doubt. It is such a hard. All problem. right, I got you an exciting mystery, mystery clip for this Let's week. Let's see it, brother. Because we got some exclusive footage here. My in collaboration with Mr. T. Lexify and oh. the goal of remastering Die Rise on Black Ops 3. Wait, what is this? I have the privilege of providing some exclusive and oh. foreseen footage and updates on the chat. W. I remember giving him this. I don't know if this is an exclusive the progress that they made. On I don't know if this is exclusive now, but we'll see. On chat. their Die Rise we'll remaster. See. I think I did some give him some, some gameplay features. Here that have yet to be revealed to the public. What I have for Let's you see. is about a minute and a half of Die Rise update footage. Chat! Here we go, boys! Show some things that haven't been fully publicly this acknowledged so that are funny. on the map. The so, I'm gonna go ahead and let that play. See if you can spot what's Chat, new. I look dapper there. And enjoy this lie. exclusive look Matt's at the Die Rise remaster. Oh yeah, chat, I remember this. Expect me to shoot the ground a lot just because I wanted people to see the shooting effects. But yeah, lads, this was... So the second tower has been fully finished. Zell is actually uploading a new video uh, showing all of the new progress that he's done. But yeah, chat, Q1 2024, this will be finished. How tall are you? I'm 6'1", 6 one, six foot one. But yeah. Also, I love the way that the chickum in this game reloads better like look at that reload i think that's a better reload than the way it reloaded in bo2 and the details ella has added oh the map the lighting in this map as well like the the skybox is looking great the guns look great yeah the new we added the xpr we so we did add new guns into the map but they're all bo2 campaign guns so like xpr 50 uh, what's another one we added? The MSMC from multiplayer is in this. Uh, we've added a bunch of BO2 weapons. 
I'm showing I'm trying to hit the strafe jump, but I'm an absolute idiot. So there you go. M27. I don't know all of the exact weapons right now, but in the current build that we have, we did the only other new ones I think we have the MSMC, the XGR50. Alright, lads. Hope you enjoyed um, this episode. You got clips. You know where to submit them. We got a Link lot in the description. Of too. As always. It shows which gun is mule kick on the bottom right. Yeah, we wanted to make sure we added that too. W video Lucario. Yes, chat. I'm telling you, we will also have a trailer out soon. It will just be sick. All the stuff we're doing. Game breaking pads are sold that bug. Let's Hello, go. Everyone. Does Who's Who work? This yeah, it's remodeled it so much stuff. better. Like the way Who's Who work essentially is that you get a better gun dependent on the round that you're on. So that just makes Who's Who way more valuable. And after round 100, you get an upgraded ballistic knife. So all you have to do is shoot yourself. Oh, he's dead. <gasps> that is so lame. He would have died there without dying wish. Electric fire zombies, Olympia by the gang way. could never. Could you imagine? That is such a dumb way to die. You really take out the zombies and die. M14 on BO3 gameplay. This, this is truly one six. of a kind. It was so weird that they just added this gun like way after the life cycle of Chronicles even. It's like this. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he's dead. How? Mac attack with the clutch on the M14? Bro, yeah, Olympia would not be able to hit that clutch. I'm gonna just be real for you. I'm gonna just be full on real with you. Bro, what the? I was trying to get the perma perk PhD. I'm dead. That's literally me. World Customs truly existed in an alternate timeline, but you still gotta remember it's two hit down. Oh, bro, this map is amazing. For you guys who don't know what this one's called, this is the original dead ship map. It's a pirate ship zombies map on World at War. They brought it to Black Ops 3, but I personally like the World at War version better. Oh, it's such a sick map. Oh, but the gravity hole zombies, bro. Yeah, no way. That's crazy. Oh, this area is so buggy. He's dead. He's dead? He lives! He would be so dead without double tap, though. Oh my goodness. What the heck? Tokyo coming in with a clutch. What the heck is this, man? Look how fast you are. Lightning die, ether shroud, stamina. Whoa, you're literally some speed. You're literally faster than a car. Yeah, see, I tried <laughs> to get done. Look how fast he is! But I didn't activate it. What is that? No, that's literally the strat, by the way, for outbreak round 100. You literally just charge your lightning die down and you just run across the map like a madman. I guarantee you they're gonna have the same no. thing. Prime example. They're gonna have the same thing for Modern Warfare. Why theater mode needs 100 percent guarantee you. Gotta spectate the random happenings that happen to the noobs in our public matches, right? Oh my gosh, he's got coagulant. Wait. Death is coming bro from the doesn't guy. know. No, bro doesn't know. Wait, what? Did he hit the Samantha? No, he hit the Samantha glitch. Yeah, I feel like that's an easy way to get Samantha. Oh my gosh. I will say I am glad that the Samantha glitch is not really a thing anymore. It's mainly only on BL3. And it only ever happens because the game thinks you're trying to get more guns. So it looks like on top of Roblox, but, Fortnite, oh and Dreams, I guess Gmod also had some sort of zombies mode. Really? I know Gmod has VR. What the frick? This is Gmod? What the heck? Bro, I gotta play this. Oh, lads. Want to chat if I play Gmod Zombies? I had no clue that game had zombies. Every game is doing zombies better than Activision All right, at this point. I got point. a bit of a that shorter trivia time here. And uh, basically, this is just kind of an, a more of an impromptu trivia time. Let's hear it. I was, basically, I was going to grab footage for uh, last week's trivia time or something. And uh, you'll just see. I'm just going to let the footage play. Okay, let's see it. What am I looking at here? 
Roblox zombie slaps. No, it literally does. Oh, no way! <gasps> what? You can do PhD flopper and whip out the shield to get the G-Strike Elims? What? Oh my gosh, that is sick! Only on BO2, though. So yeah, the more you oh know, my gosh, not that only is, is it possible to dolphin dive with a shield, which is honestly what? something that I knew for a while, but uh, also, you can that whip if you it do out dolphin dive with a shield, while you have PhD and get flopper, all the melee kills will actually count. <laughs> now, I mean, filter. I don't think this is going to yeah, be like, saturation anything that's going to change. Like, this isn't going to be like any sort of information that's going to change. It's not a speedrun speed strat, like that. I but highly it's still... Doubt that. It's still a useful uh, just because knowledge, I'm though. I'm pretty sure there's. I never knew you could whip out the shield mid dolphin uh, dive. Uh, with the ice staff in BO2 That's Origins. Wild. What That's wild. That's definitely heck? much easier and much safer. I'm telling you, I learned something you know, new I'm about sure Origins every that day. No one here <laughs> has ever managed to fill up uh, the G strike. Every day I learned something new about PhD Origins. a flopper and a shield. Maybe wow. with the ice staff, but definitely not by using this, so. Uh, Hey, this makes me wonder if a no gun origins Easter egg is possible. Like you just you don't shoot any zombies. All you use is PhD and just like melees. You could probably do it. A no gun origins Easter egg. I think it's possible. The more you know, I you guess. You could literally try do it. it out. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, that's about all I got for this. I'm telling you, the Back map that keeps on giving scheduled clips. Chat by next year, we're gonna know 500 other more things about origins. There's gonna be so many more things. Def gotta have a lot of love for the Wonder Fizz, but the fact that that's even a thing is insane. You got it. It's a 75G gamer score? That's crazy. I didn't know it was that much. I mean, it's honestly worth it. The Orange Beast Strike is so good. Bro got dead shot, lol. Look up! Look up! No! Look up! Look up when you do the final step! No! No, don't you die! Oh my gosh, I've never seen this happen. Don't die. Use the back of the staff. Use the back of the staff. Use the back. Oh no. Oh no, his friends. Oh, he got a new. Oh my gosh. If they wouldn't have beat the egg right there, I would have cried. Somebody in this planet has definitely failed on the last step there. Oh my gosh, he finally realized he could have looked up. Bro, that had me in a heart attack for a whole minute there. The oh my gosh, that is crazy. Cannot break free. No, I've seen this glitch before. Oh my gosh, what the heck? It was you who first I don't think you can ever fix this glitch. Yeah. If, if you accidentally kill the Panzer at the perfect time, your game just goes sideways. Oh my goodness, this is so trippy to look at. If only to what die the heck? Day. Oh my gosh. What <laughs> bro's oh, playing Horde sideways? I've seen people get in gameplay like this, but I never knew this is how you actually do it. It's with the Panzer pulling you. And it's wild, because this is on BO3 as well. This isn't just a BO2 thing. Oh, I feel bad, bro. Now, like I said in the trivia time, something like that probably wouldn't Both see any sort of useful speedrun usage, but something like this might. I'm curious what this is going to be. Is this the little army set? Oh, what the frick? I think people have been using this in the WR. If you change rounds with the Margua, yeah, you can literally complete the whole thing. I think I have seen that before. That's insane. Oh my gosh. So yeah, you notice as soon as the round changed, like so that step, he spawns the three uh, Marguas in with the little Arnies. And then he swaps the round, and what it does is it takes out all the Margos that spawned in. So look, it's round 14, the Arties are, or the Margos spawn in, he ends the round, and they all die. That's crazy. That's definitely a world record strat. Easily, yeah, that's 100% a world record strat. 
Because what you could do is you could spawn all nine of them in and then just take them all out instantaneously like that. That is busted, bro. What the heck? That is busted. Oh my goodness. Bro, the, the, the clutches people hit here just before they go into the crazy place. Oh! Oh, no way! Oh, bro! Get clips, link in the description Dang. once again. Is this the Ender Dragon boss fight in World at War? Yeah. What am I witnessing? I'll see you the next episode. Bro's got the freaking yeah. Ray K assault rifle. What the frick is going on, fam? Legendary clip. Shout out to Lucario. Okay. The ultimate ray gun troll. Chat, I'm telling you, I learn something new every Hello, day everyone. with this these fails. Your right? weekly Let's dose of zombies. It. Gonna be honest. This episode oh, features really quite a bit it. of the game doing a little bit of trolling. Yeah. So why not start with Cold War? Yeah, the classic troll game mode. The trolling game mode of all time. Is that Ronald Reagan? That might be. What is bro doing? What is bro up to? Hello? He's just not dying. He's living forever. I, I do see that on Cold War. Oh, Ronald Reagan Brain Rot. Oh my gosh. And you get a Ray Gun from that. That's insane. So it's, I do notice that Brain Rot can be very glitchy on Cold War. It just, some, it just sometimes just doesn't work. No! Not right. This is not cool. <laughs> Bullshit. <laughs> no, dude, that is crazy. Rule. His friend did him dirty there. In the spikes with the napalm. No, thank you, my guy. That's hilarious. My man's on the transit round 100 gameplay grind. Hey, this is a shred I did. Oh, no! No, he came up at the, the first time. Turn your shield away. Does he live? Oh my gosh, what a clutch! Oh, what a clutch! Oh my gosh, I did not expect him to live that. That's a huge clutch. What the heck? I don't even know what guns the- Bro's on the cheats, my guy. Hey, speaking of Roblox zombies, boys, we made it! The Roblox zombie fail clips have finally appeared. We're back. Where are these homies going? They're going to the pack a punch, bro. The not pack a punch. It is insane how many zombie modes are on Roblox for COD zombies. There's like a good handful. I think it's like between 5 to 10. Which is insane. They want a pat, but everyone's using it. POV, the Keynote or Toten pack a punch. <laughs> Everybody's like, bro, let me use it before we go. Let me use it. He used PhD on the plane wing. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. I was wondering, how did he fly Shadows that of Evil far? Tram, am I right? So oh. good, I literally got two clips back to back. Bro, I love this dude's weapon kit camo. It looks like the afterlife. Or, yeah, it looks like the beast mode or afterlife. Looks sick. Oh, we got another tram clip here. He's about to fly away. Have you ever gone on the tram, y'all, and, like, the symbol doesn't load in? I've had that so many times where you're on the tram and there's just no symbol. You're like, where's the symbol? Didn't load in. Call of Duty but. Bro, what the heck? And he saw his other self over there. What the heck? Bro, how are y'all getting these tram fails? I've never seen these ever, bro. What the... <laughs> bro hit a death barrier? Oh my gosh. Bro, you can't trust the tram in 2023, apparently. Any new perks on Die Rise Remastered? Yep. We got banana cloud sure we got snail paste slurpee. Very familiar with the Call of the PhD. Dead intro cutscene and the very Pretty obvious fun. Michael Rooker shooting five shots out of two double barrel shotguns. Yes, but yes. what if I were to tell you that that wasn't the only it's on weapon mishap yes. scene in a trailer? And as you can it's probably see by the fact that I got some 
uh, Shangri La gameplay in the background. Yeah, this I'm was sure very you could recent. Probably guess on which I can't map remember this comes who from. said this. This little weapon I never realized comes this from the Shangri La gameplay trailer, and it's a very, very brief moment in the trailer. But uh, if we break it down in super slow motion, Let's we see can it. see that Dempsey here has uh, an Olympia and fires it once, twice, three times, twice, <gasps> four times. Five times? Three times. Now oh, it five times, bro! That was five times! What the frick? I'm telling you, y'all, like, I remember going to Treyarch Studios when they were filming the Derizon Drac trailers, and I know these dudes play with God Mode and Infinite Ammo. So that honestly does not surprise me that they left that in the trailer. It was a very abrupt Bro's clip cut right there, option, for but real. Uh, especially with also yeah. not having the, uh, I the audio. I know of the they play with freaking uh, you know we don't want to get God or like, like God like mode that because, and uh, infinite ammo. Music and uh, Activision doesn't like me, but anyways, if you actually we look at the trailer, Activision. you can definitely hear uh, the uh, the Olympia firing sound effect three, so times. three times. With this being oh. a trailer uploaded to YouTube instead of. The actual intro cutscene, something like that, would definitely somebody at Treyarch is Olympia gang and is trying to gas up the Olympia. Up here. Uh, not be noticed. As They're trying to gas it up, like man. Call of the Dead, Michael. They're trying to hype it up. It ain't that. But, uh, it ain't that big of a deal. For sure. Someone got fired for the that. Only one. Probably. But yeah, that's about all They're I got. Like, for, why'd you uh, make the Olympia shoot so many times? Time. We're M14 gang. Back to the regularly scheduled clips. Oh my goodness. Oh, another man, another epic ghost shout. Bro, I love your weapon kit camo. This is probably one of the best weapon kits I've ever seen. Chat, one in the chat if you agree. That that weapon kit looks so good. Even on the Dracon, bro. Bro's a designer. I actually love that. That is so good looking. He can design I'm gonna that. I'm going to myself. <laughs> He's going to design that weapon I kit. But oh, can't open up the Origins robot foot. Is when I It'd be up. like that, truly. No! No! What the heck? The fire no. sale ended? No! Oh, that's sad. He, he no ends way. up with the Locust instead. How is that even possible? Bruh, that's... That's a skill issue if I've ever seen it. Average Origins Black Ops 3 gameplay. What is this zombie invincible? I must find a way to survive. What? That's gonna be used in a speed run. I'm calling it right now. That's gonna be used in a speed run. What did I just watch? Bro hit a knife lunge in VL3. That's gonna be used in a speed run. I'm telling you. That's a speed run clip right there. As long as he doesn't hit the death grip. No way! How did they both die? Did did bro jump on his head? All right, or let's do some attempt to break down what happened in this. Yeah, clip. what happened so, here? I know the guy holding the wind staff is like AFK or something, right? There. Yeah, that's what he said in the uh, submission. Yeah, he looks but, AFK. Uh, I think <laughs> bro with the ice staffs like how actually tried to grab them both at the same time. What? Like, I don't know how. Oh, let's... look, they're both doing the shoot claw animation. Somehow they tried to grab them both at the same time. As you can see... <gasps> I've never seen that. So they both got grabbed, and I was right. They got grabbed, and one of the players was... The guy with the ice staff was on top of the guy with the wind staff, and they both died. It's like in Keen Order Totem where you jump on someone and you die. It's basically just that, but the Panzers orchestrated it. Oh my gosh, that is a deadly combination. Uh, the uh, guy with Bro. the wind staff. What uh, an flinches. insane clip. And uh, after the game over, you can see the claw around him, even though... This is a one uh, in a million clip, literally. Grabbed. You could and probably... The, uh, the you could. Pro it would probably take you hours to recreate this clip, legit. Claw. Uh, oh my gosh! Towards him. Now they know not to be so really side think by side. The yeah, Panzers that's crazy. really just managed to grab them both and death barrier them both. Yeah, that they got the death barrier glitch, like the one on top of the other. Clip right there. Never that that is a one in a million for sure. You yeah, would never see another clip like that. Down of this clip, and uh, with that, wow, crazy clip, man. That is literally you never see that before.
I've never seen that before, and I've been doing fails for like five We've plus years. We've had a lot of recent talks about the super Easter egg in oh, Black Ops no. 3. And Lads, admit it. Accept it. It's a joke. It's a bluff. The impossible Easter egg is Black Ops 4 being a good zombies game. Okay, come on. A couple of like, <laughs> I'm joking. Not no, Easter eggs that have right. recently been discovered. Like how uh, Origins, Darius and Drac, and Zetsubo all had uh, moments or things that have been fairly closely uh, based off of things that happen in movies and such. So, with that, and with Bro's Brundell having already noir, confirmed uh, that mode. the impossible Easter egg is not any sort of, like, trigger Easter egg or is no, not something that's going it's to a change visual the thing. map itself, is not going to have any sort of gameplay effect. Lads, I guarantee you this impossible egg is going to be solved, like, in 25 years from now. Somebody's going to be playing Shadows of Evil and just randomly find it. It is pretty safe to say that perhaps thinking that the impossible Easter egg is something along those lines could also be the case. With that being said... I low-key do uh, think also it's something to do with the noir mode. I honestly do think that uh, that's what it is. video recently came out by a channel called Grim's Apathy, who tried taking a stab at what the impossible Easter egg could be thinking along those lines. And what they say is that... The, that the impossible Easter egg could be something to do with the laundry ticket, as most of us think, or oh, which has been uh, one of the main Oh, that's so smart. Yeah, like the laundry ticket that you get for the free 500 points. points that, it is. that would make so much sense. Something to do uh, with the laundry ticket for And the noir mode reasons, Easter egg, but probably. It's like a the combination of movie references. Of side Easter eggs. They think that the way we obtain the laundry ticket in game and why it exists in game is actually because it's supposed to be a reference to a movie called The Untouchables, where in that movie there is a speakeasy that is disguised as a laundromat, which, you know, sound familiar, right? It could all be coincidence, and then he does bring up some more points in the video, which obviously video link in the description and all of that. So, I don't know. What do you think? Could this be the solve? Could this be just one part of it? The thing is, is that I think it's a visual Easter egg. If I were to get my best stab at it, it's a visual Easter egg that you... There's no triggers. There's nothing in the game files talking about this. It, so, which means it confirms it's a visual Easter egg. There's nothing that you can do in game, but it's something related to Are we a, all, something visual. I in guess the map. we'll all find out. Maybe if Blundell actually appears again and he never tells will. us what the uh, never impossible will. Easter egg actually is he, after the eight years, like he what never was will. said. Epson shot. He never will. But yeah, he never will. Another could be. He never will come out and do it ever. He never yeah. freaking will. That's really about all I got for this video. Bruh, what a sad way to end it. He's never going to show you guys. The impossible Easter egg is dead. The impossible Easter egg is getting Jason Wendell back to work at Treyarch, boys. Hello, everyone. The real ray gun every time method, boys. Let's get it. Let's so get recently, it. we've been seeing a lot of clips of Mark II splash damage. But what if the problem goes deeper than that? Does the Boom Hill have splash damage? No way. How could the Bloom Hill have splash damage? Possible Easter egg is Blundell rejoining deviation games. Yeah, for real. What the f what did he get hit by? What? 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 Bro got hit by the invisible zombie! The Boom Hilda! I don't even know how he died. He got hit by literally nothing. If that doesn't prove to you how wonky the World at War Zombies are, I don't know what does. That was wild. Bro got lassoed in like Indiana Jones out here. What the heck? Classic World at War grab the whole zombie moments. Right, see you in Firebase Z, my guy. Oh my gosh. 
What the heck? Oh, big clutch. Oh, here we go. Whip out that in the highlighter if you want to make it a wild clutch, bro. Bro got absolutely launched. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, that's what happens when you whip out the L4 Siege. Let me just tell you straight right there. My oh, man's hitting trick shots on Rev. What's going on here? No way! Okay, bro is showing off. Oh, bro is showing off. <laughs> bro, that's actually an EE -E strat. That's a world record strat. If you're hitting those mid-jump pad, that's probably a world record strat right there. I, I really like that's this E-tool setup I'm using right now. It's like perfect. Yeah, I had that on my... Um, Classic uh, Thumper strat on Cold War. Spam it and win. The last one you did? Wait, what the heck? <laughs> yeah. Bo's got the hell? Hell's Retriever glitch. Dude, <laughs> I saw that. I was still that? What the fuck was that? That dude, that he was threw a Tomahawk on the ship, still floating in midair. Yeah, Bo's got the Mob of the Dead Flame glitch my second right abilities there. to fucking freeze it. In the the China Drake. Boys, we finally found it. There have been many imitators, but here we found the actual, tried and true, ray gun every time no method. No way! 100% works. We did it! No way! It's only been 12 years, man. It's almost it's only been half my entire life. 15 years. Okay? W, how do you do it, though? Oh, my... Nah, fam. Get his friend in. Is his friend gonna hit a ray gun? What, is he gonna get Mark II? Wait, what? But he picked up the ray gun. Totally not a mod menu sources, dude, trust me. Me thinking it's actually legit. Phase Blaze? Chat, should I make a TikTok? Bro, hit the dual wield ray guns right there. Burrito King, what a name. Legendary name, fam. How's Bro gonna make it out of this? Oh my gosh. Yeah, the Nuketown clutches go different. There's something about the layout of that map. Even on zombies, when you hit the clutch like that, it just is different for sure. Oh, That's the right. one thing I noticed. In Outbreak, you never get clutch clips. Did you guys notice that? Because of open world zombies, you will never get those type of clips. That's Even the biggest this issue. This is probably going to be one of the easiest trivia times that I've done so far, and this is definitely okay, one come of on. the, if this is the easy most well-known uh, discrepancies. I gotta know it. That, uh, is this phase blaze calling the cabinet the pack punch? Treyarch zombies map, and especially since it's a something that's in a World at War zombies map. Okay. So My this World has just been a thing for rusty. years, Can't and it's a pretty good chance that most people know about it. But anyways, simple question. Let's see it. How much does the Thompson cost? Very simple question, right? You would. I'm stumped. I don't even know. My guess is tw Is it twelve fifty? Oh no, I'm stumped. Or is it thirteen hundred? No, it's not thirteen hundred. Oh no, lads, how can he get me on something so easy? It's either twelve hundred or twelve fifty. Ask, but uh, I'm guessing twelve fifty. You go though. out of the two hundred and twenty-three oh, votes that I've actually gotten for this, which is probably don't, one of the uh, don't most do amount this. of votes that I've gotten for one of these so don't far. Don't do this. Uh, most players think that it is twelve hundred no, points. No, twelve fifty. Twelve fifty. So, did the majority get it right? No, the majority is always wrong on this. Well, as I said, this is probably one of the most well-known discrepancies. Or is the majority right? Anything. So as we go here, it says it costs 1500 But if we go back and look at the footage again, it actually only costs 1200 The majority was finally right. I should have trusted them. Oh my goodness, fam. And uh, the other You've thing is... You've been scammed! Go up to it. I got the easiest trivia time question wrong. L. Uh, going to try to oh rebuy ammo, it gosh. actually does correctly say that it's 1,200 points, so... 
I don't play it's World of War Zombies. It's just kind of wild to That's my see, excuse. Like, this is, like, this is something all I, the way back I don't play World, World of War, you can't even, that just you can't never even got blame fixed. me. You can't even blame me for that, but yeah. This was a... I'm almost very... certain, bro, it's 1250 under East. Am I scamming myself? I'm probably Easy, scamming myself at this point. Quite well known little discrepancy. That's horrendous, back, man. You know, I'm that down bad. That, well, the or is it twelve fifty on everyone. Mob of the Dead? Boys, how much is the Tommy gone on Mob of the Dead? Actually, getting a trivia time right. Is it not twelve uh, fifty? Or isn't it more? Maybe it's more groups. on Mob. Of the Dead. I don't freaking know. Yeah, isn't it fifteen hundred? Yeah, Mob of the Dead is expensive. It is not worth the fifteen hundred. I'm just gonna be real with you. It's max should be 1200, 1250, 1300. That's as high as I go. <laughs> That's as high as I go. What are you doing? Grave X. What the frick? Three player round 245? How has your game even lasted this long, Fountain? Oh, I, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. What are y'all doing? Shut the fuck dude. up. What the Thank frick? Thank you for screaming, though. I appreciate it. 245. Honestly. They hit the world record. Oh, my gosh. Three-player WRs around 314. That's insane. How long was that game? Chat, take a guess. How long was that game? That game must have been over two days. Easily. That must have been 48 hours plus. Hello? Bro hit bro just hit the any rubber here. Any rubber here. Confirm what the Bro just found the secret room in it, the impossible Easter egg. It was in town. What the heck? It is wild that you, we are still getting new glitches and new fails from the oldest games in COD Zombies. I think that's like what makes it so fascinating to watch all these. How in the world are half of these fails even possible at this point? Oh, what a clutch! The CZ75 clutch, man. Right through the top of the stairs like that. Sheesh, man. Bro, hit the everywhere but here gobble gum. <laughs> Round 15 with the boy. Yeah, you know it's BO2 because the zombies be walking like it's round one. Oh, he's dead. Oh, bro, what the? Bro, I love BO2 because you can hit these type of clutches because the zombies take like a little bit of time to hit you. That would never have happened on BO3. That would have been an instant L. Instantaneous. The transponder is the thing that's used pretty much literally only for... Which shot fives was the one where there was a clutch and after Lex ran through a bunch of boxes? I don't know what to tell you, man. I don't know what to tell you. I glitches. know which one you're talking about, but I don't know this what the deal that was. This is a thing. But basically, there are two types of glitches with the transponder. There's the ones that sit outside the map in an invincibility spot, some sort of pile-up spot. They go AFK so that uh, everyone else in the lobby gets screwed over and they oh, don't get Oh, and this is how keys. you get out of space. And then there's know. this type of player. M16 was in BL2? Oh, yeah. I'm so we were playing with the M16 today on tracks, didn't we? It's in the very first map. Bro, this is... Spaceline has some of the most insane glitches. There's a glitch on this map to get the freaking exosuit. Like, what? Bro's hitting trick shots outside of the map, my G. What the heck? Wait, let me see that again. That was clean. Oh my goodness. Lads, I'm telling you, Zombies has better trick shots than multiplayer. All right, Confirmed. lads, that's it for this episode. Did you guys see that jump scare trick shot I showed you on Mob of the Dead? That was literally the best trick shot I've ever seen in my life. One in the chat if you saw it, two in the chat if you didn't. If you didn't, I'm going to pull it up right now. It was that good. I'm looking for it right freaking now. It was, oh, right here, boys. Look at this. If you have not seen this, this is gas. Look at this right here. This is the best trick shot I've ever seen in my life. With the, with the jump scare? With the jump scare? It doesn't get better than that.
It doesn't it it doesn't get better than that. It doesn't get better than that. Zombie trick shots better than multiplayer trick shots. You can't name me one multiplayer trick shot better than that. Friendly fire will not be tolerated, boys. This is the final video. Fs and chat. Let's get Hello into everyone. It. This is your weekly dose of zombies. We as a community are so content deprived, we gotta make our own <laughs> boss fights. <laughs> You got him, bro! You got him! Get him! Get him! He's low HP! He's low HP! Get him, bro! You got him! You got him! You got him, my man! Almost dead! <laughs> Attack on Titan BS right there, bro, for real. <laughs> yep, that's the moon jumpers for you. I remember that was the first time I died in moon. That was the first way I died. I went on the lander, ran right into the building, jumped up, and it just sent me. And really I died. had the tool to be able to save himself right there. Yeah, he, he did. He could have used ABH. Ooh, the, is this the best zombies map of all time? Guys, it's the best zombies map of all time. I can't believe it. I can't believe it, lads. This is the best zombies map. We finally made it. I've been waiting for this moment for so long. What? His friend shot him and he died. How is that possible? Excuse me? I know like on Ascension when you activate the turrets, the turrets can shoot you, but I've never known that a downed player could shoot you. Is that real? What I'm thinking might have happened is that he shot his friend and maybe it knocked him back into the zombie which hit him. That was probably actually what happened. But still, regardless, that's it. What the f Bro, what are Revelation zombies on? This is what I'm saying. These guys are on crack, fam. What the heck are they doing? Bro's hitting the exosuit launch right there. Oh... Bro's about to get sideways gameplay. Did he hit the Samantha glitch? Wait, what's going on? What in the world just happened? How did he go from MG? Oh, because of migrating hosts, fam. I'm telling you, anything's possible during migrating hosts. Anything is... Wait, what the frick? Legit. Oh, yeah. He's sideways now. Yeah. Bro, it's... Dempsey He's in the Primus upside down. This next clip. Oh my goodness. World at War zombie mechanics would simply be like. Oh yeah. You can survive anything with World at War jug, pretty much. That's what I mean, man. Going for the round of hundreds on World at War would be a nightmare with those mechanics, bro. An absolute nightmare. Like, I just can't imagine playing with those type of gravity hole zombies like that. Oh, big ether shroud. Bro, what is this weapon? This thing looks garbo. I remember the pistols in Cold War and the snipers were terrible. <gasps> Bro's hitting the PhD slider strats. <laughs> what the heck? Bro, that was that was the annihilator. Same damage, same everything. Yeah, you're right, bro. Hello? <laughs> the way he died, he just fell over. Why did he do it like that? That was hilarious. <laughs> he just ran into the barrel. Oh, brother, live! No. Oh. Why are they getting infected? I don't understand. I know, bro. Bro, trash. They were literally inside of it. They, that's the problem when you're doing this Shut melee up, step. I get my it's literally so... No! Oh, he didn't realize I'm about the two mind. hit. No. No, man. And just imagine an AI in Modern Warfare 3 will record all of that in game chat. Oh, what an incredible game. Rip Mr. Pancakes, man. Bless him into the next one. Oh, yep. Yeah, it's the DG4 glitch. 
That homie's going through some electroshock therapy right now. Look at him. What is he doing, fam? Bro, he, he this is not a good looking sight, man. Zombie seizure. Oh, is there still an invisible zombie though? He on death row. <laughs> He's like, bro, give me my last meal before I die. He's just straight chilling. He's having a great time, man. <laughs> He's got no head! Whoa! He was able to take him out. Usually you're not able to take them out. That is actually impressive. Shout out to Trin. Hey, man. it's very simple, no right? Game. All you have to do is oh, just Beast don't run, right? Just L. do not run. Literally, do not use a core so gameplay. So many people don't know that, though, with the ninja zombies. If you run, they teleport in front of you and you get, get bullied. Up zombies, just as do as not you run, run you're, right? You're don't run. He's done. He's done. Bro, this weapon looks horrific. What the heck even is this? Oh my gosh. Like, look at that. How is that fair? They cornered him into one alien. And he's gonna run as soon as he comes out, huh? He's gonna die instantly. I can feel it. He's dead. I hear them. It's literally... The ninja zombies in this game were so busted. He even activated Scorching Skin. He's gonna die. He's still gonna die. Oh, he's so dead. <laughs> yeah, that's got to be the most broken zombie ever. Bro most broken zombie type ever to be made. That is horrific gameplay. The Karate Kid is back, man. He's on. You look warfare. like you enjoy some Morse code steps. Woo! Said literally no one ever. Me. So, uh, since we all love Morse code steps, so chat guess this zombies map. I guarantee you won't even be able to guess. It's a World War II zombies. I know which one this is. Ninety-nine percent of people don't know what the zombies map is. It's Shadowed Throne. That's correct. Much. What if there was a way to just you know? This map is so... not do them. Just completely bypass That's any wild. of the actual Morse code part of the step and just, you know, complete the step without having to do I don't even know this Easter egg Luckily, at one all. of the most solo like, unfriendly zombies maps of all time has you covered. So here on the Shadowed Throne, oh, you're supposed yeah, to- Oh yeah, there's a Morse code step on this, but why? I would never do this Easter egg solo. To go up to ever. this dumb map and like literally while the zombies are still attacking, you go and place a magnifying glass on a specific grid coordinate that why? you would have, uh, and in order to find out what your grid coordinate actually is, you're supposed to- That's why I don't play World War II, bro. At least the Exo Zombie Easter eggs, for the most part, were soloable. Do some dumb Morse Half code step, World but uh, we're not doing that. You know, we're just horrific. completely bypassing the whole Morse code step and just skipping straight to finding- Even this Wonder Weapon was not that great. The Wonder Bus? Uh, the code, or the grid coordinate on this map- will only ever be one of 12 locations, so we can just brute force it. I mean, it's still a What very kind of annoying... step is this? You move literally one inch to get to where you need to go. Process is still what a very the heck? friendly process because, uh, as you can see, the zombies are still attacking you whenever you're trying to- And you have to buy jug every step. time. What a And map. obviously, in order to confirm it, you have to hover over it and then exit out of the map every time to see if it was or wasn't correct. Oh and after that gosh. painful process, when you finally do land on your correct grid coordinate, uh, the cabinet next to this map will end up opening up, and you are able to continue you on with the step bowl. Uh, without having to do any Morse code. You know, it's great. I mean... Yeah, lads, I'm gonna be real. I give Shadow Throne a lot of credit, but, like, going through this egg is rough. It's I suppose the good it. thing that you can do about this is you can get this step done, like, really early. Uh, that's kind of the issue with this map. This is my also biggest problem with World War II. Name me another color you see on the screen other than gray. Is that after... That isn't in the progress, UI. Even the uh, reds look great. This map a little bit. It just it's spawns so super great. You know that the special enemies. Like, it looks like you're looking through like a gray feature of this map. Just we love super sprinters, right? Super sprinters are fantastic. You know, we just we absolutely oh love my gosh. that. You can it's only round thirteen as well. You can't see it. Not but you literally cannot save a zombie 13. in this 
in this map just because every single time they will turn into a super sprinter big l i oh hate this map goodness. it is literally one of the most solo unfriendly maps of all time and it's really unfortunate because world war ii they literally put all of the side easter eggs in this map really but the map is so so well, i didn't even know that that even with I this, it makes it this is probably my least played zombies map of all time shadow throne or tortured path i'm telling you world war ii zombies was not it like, like I what? people give this game too much credit in my Bearable, opinion. but I don't care. I would literally rather play the Darkest Shore, and I'm not even I'm not even joking about that. I actually don't mind the Darkest Shore too much, but uh, World War II Final Reich was incredible. The DLC for this game was trash. This map is still every DLC map that map. came out for World War II Zombies was so oh, mid. Very solo one friendly. And again, I also have. Because at least with, like, Beast from Beyond, it's at least a c somewhat colorful map. This map is, n like, Early put it's in not even fun Turkish, to look I mean, at. Uh, into uh, the Frozen Dawn. Honestly, I still need to learn that map. Nah, straight up. I, uh, World War II I, I is easily my yet. least played zombies game the, next the to Vanguard. Probably and is what is the common theme between World War II and Vanguard? World War II zombie games are not it. Period. World War played. Two zombie Except for games Vanguard, like, are probably terrible. My least played, but that's besides the point. Uh, let me, no yeah, more World War Two. Back to the regularly scheduled clips. I'm rambling. only World at War is the good zombies game, but too much. The modern World War Two COD games have terrible zombie modes. I I I think people give World War Two too much credit. I I do not like this game. Round two hundred on Revelations of the God Mask. What am I witnessing? World at War is the only exception. Oh no. Bro busted his game. What the heck? The Thunder Gun did nothing. Man. Bro, what? I've never seen this glitch. The zombies just don't is die. Actually, not a functional game anymore. He's literally getting attacked by an invisible Megaton. What the frick? I'm telling- no, it's actually so true. I genuinely believe Cold War has had some of the worst launch or post-launch support ever. Like, after the game's life cycle has finished, this game has absolutely deteriorated. Like, you cannot play this game without having, like, some severe problems. Like, li bro's literally fighting no one. He's fighting his ghosts. <laughs> Bro's playing Call of Duty Ghosts. He's fighting his ghosts right now, fam. Oh my goodness. He's literally fighting his inner demons. <laughs> He's fighting the freaking. Look at this. He's shooting nothing. <laughs> what the heck? Like, how is World at War more functional than that? World at freaking war. I've never seen one invisible zombie in World at War. Like, that's insane to me, man. Thank you, Wild Dog, for the Prime PG. That's actually great. That's actually oh, mind blowing to think about, though. Oh my what gosh. The they pushed him out, bro. Did y'all just see that? Uh, yeah, bro. I saw that. Bro got pushed out like a baby right there, bro. What the heck? Hey, Die Rise! The best zombies map of all time, Die Rise! The map I'm the map I'm recreating in God Tier BO3 format. A Burrito King is down! He is the new Adam, bro! B Rip Burrito King. Oh, this bro is done. Oh, the luckiest nuke of all time. Yeah, that man is the new Adam. X Burrito King X. What a legend. Absolute legend. Uh, Lex, I apologize oh, no. in advance. Has Die Rise shifted in your tier list any ever since you started the remaster? Yes. Die Rise went from a D tier map, and my remaster will make it at maximum B or A tier. We'll have to see. Vance. Oh, no. But uh, you can fully blame the YouTube algorithm for this one. Am I getting roasted? D, E, first attempt. Oh, no, chat. I'm about to get clowned on. I'm about to get clowned on chat. Oh no. To go back and get some more KRM ammo, which was like all the all the all the all the way back here. I don't think we have enough. I'm about to get clowned. We gotta time these grenades, man. I am really suffering here. Why is this 
YouTube algorithm is so bizarre. They're like, let me just recommend you a video from like nine years ago for absolutely no reason. No. <laughs> no. Why did I not just run to the KRM? How far my skills have improved from going to this to being now able to like do jet gun strats. Crazy. That was uh... That was pretty new. Man, I'm getting scared because I don't know I don't know how I'm gonna kill these things. I'm completely out of ammo. I have no And I don't think I either. have enough ammo to take down these guys. Corona double I don't tap. think I do. No, 380! 380! I dude, if I literally prone that double tap, I would have got it. I don't know how I'm gonna do this, dude. I really should have picked up that max ammo. Do I really die okay, on round six? Okay, this is six? gonna be dangerous! I'm gonna die on round six, man. No, don't no! Die. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Practice game. Practice game. I was playing offline, fam. I got bullied.